Southport Pier. Southport Pier is a pleasure pier in Southport, Merseyside, England. The Southport Pier tramway ran from Southport Promenade to the pier head at various times in the pier's history with various rolling stock, most recently until June 2015. The pier is recorded in the National Heritage List for England as a designated Grade II listed building, first listed on 18 August 1975. The pier's primary purpose was to be a promenade as opposed to a ship docking pier, and thus is considered to be the country's first pleasure pier. A year later, on 2 August 1860, the pier was officially opened with a grand procession. At a length of 1100 meters, it was the second longest and first iron constructed pleasure pier in the country. Profits fell during the 1930s depression, compounded with a large fire in July 1933 destroying the pier head. The cost of damage was estimated at £6,000, which was unaffordable to the Southport Pier Company, who ended up selling the pier to Southport Corporation in June 1936 for £34,744. The pier did not reopen again until 1950 and in June 1959 suffered a significant fire which destroyed 460 square meters of decking, reducing its length to the present day 3,633 feet, and for a period of time making it the third longest pier after Hern Bay Pier, until that was destroyed by a storm in 1978. Operating at an annual loss of 100,000 pounds, and with estimates close to one pound per million to secure the future of the pier, plus a further £250,000 acquired every five years for repainting. A charitable trust was formed in 1993 to upkeep the pier. Various funding was secured in the subsequent years to maintain the pier's operation. Restoration of the pier formed part of a wider redevelopment strategy, including a new sea wall to help prevent flooding landscaping around the pier and a new 28 pounds a million ocean plaza shopping complex a 1790 12 21 21 21